13 Action News Update sponsored by Bell Medical. I'm Trisha Keen. Right now on your 13 Action News Update, a big change coming for people getting unemployment benefits with some federal programs ending after tomorrow. Dieter says it will now focus only on regular unemployment. Three federal programs in Nevada are ending, including PUA, which gave unemployment benefits to contractors or gig workers who otherwise aren't eligible to get regular unemployment benefits. Dieter says the number of applicants has been steadily dropping, but recent data shows about 40,000 people were filing claims with PUA. Tomorrow is the first Saturday of the college football season, and that means big business for local sports books. But even at the peak of the pandemic, sports betting didn't slow down, thanks to the shrinking stigma surrounding the industry and new bettors like women placing a wager. And it's even easier now to place a bet because you can do it on an app. The return of football contests are also a big draw for bettors. Circa, for example, has two contests during the NFL season, offering up a total of $10 million in prizes. Danny. Well, as we head into the holiday weekend, do expect things to heat up. Thursday, Friday, beautiful with seasonal temperatures and sunshine. That puts us in a pleasant place for your Friday night plans as a clear sky continues and the wind speeds weaken. We expect low 90s approaching sunset, upper 80s by 8 or 9, and that leads us into a beautiful Saturday morning. We'll wake up to temperatures in the 70s, but triple digit highs back in the forecast. 101 on Saturday, up to 104 on Sunday, and by Monday, Labor Day, a forecast high of 106. An of heat watch in effect Monday and Tuesday as our heating trend peaks. We will cool down a little bit next week, uh, even with the heat for the holiday weekend. Beautiful conditions with sunshine. And that was your 13 Action News update. You can always get the latest news at KTNV.com.